I'd like to close out this program on the power of intention with a story that um, was sent to me by a dear friend, Ellen. It's called Attitude. A 92-year-old, petite, well-poised, and proud lady who's fully dressed each morning by 8 o'clock, 92 years old, with her hair fashionably coiffed and makeup perfectly applied, even though she's legally blind and moved to a nursing home today. Her husband of 70 years recently passed away, making the move necessary. After many hours of waiting patiently in the lobby of this nursing home, she smiled sweetly when she told her room was now ready. As she maneuvered her walker to the elevator, I provided a visual description of her tiny room, including the eyelet sheets that had been hung on the window. I love it, she stated, with the enthusiasm of an eight-year-old, having just been presented with a new puppy. But Mrs. Jones, you haven't even seen the room yet. Just wait. That doesn't have anything to do with it, she said. Happiness is something you decide on ahead of time. Whether I like my room or not, it doesn't depend on how the furniture is arranged. It's how I arrange my mind. When you change the way you look at things, even if you're legally blind, the things you look at change. God bless you, and thank you. <laughs>